Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy Legend 2! We have to take out Odin now that we're in Valhalla. And his pets. Now, sleep there I get, because that's, you know, his horse in Norse mythology. You know, that makes sense. Uh, the bird? I don't know about that one, viewers. You got me on that one. I don't recall Odin having any bird pets in Valhalla, but we're going to take all these guys out anyway. Now the interesting thing about Sleipner is that he's a level 10 monster, so it makes for great monster meat and great transformations, uh, which is one reason why I've been using Dragon this whole time, because it'll make for a very easy and excellent transformation from here. And, and uh, not to mention, I mean, Flame is a very good ability, too. So, I mean, granted, there's some other monsters that might have been better, but they won't transform as well as I will now into Skilla. Yes! Very excellent monster. I've heard that you can also win the Gungnir Spear from Odin, but you can't do that and win, or and get the Sleep Near Me at the same time. You can only get one or the other, so. Ah, well there you go. Can I rule heaven now? Better to rule in heaven than rule in hell. Okay, well we took care of him, so let me just take a moment to heal up and then we'll press onward. Okay, we're all set and ready to go. Actually, I didn't need healing, but I did need to rearrange my party because I got that new monster there. Let's take a look at Skilla. Holy cow, look at those stats. Awesome HP, high mana, agility, defense. Got ice, fire, it's amazing. Nice thing about Skilla is that you also get Whirl, which is almost as powerful as Flare. Um, probably as powerful as Flare is for Pyro or Indy because they don't have as good mana stats. So that's awesome for them. Uh, let's see, Tail is probably still more powerful than Four Heads because it can pierce defense a little better. But, you know, I guess it depends on the situation. So, yeah, lots of very excellent attacks there. So, And it also makes for my next transformation a little easier. So let's move along then. The interesting thing about fighting Odin is if uh, you never died in the game, he'll just attack you. He won't talk or anything. And then when he dies, you just get his Magi and that's it. How many do I have anyway? Ooh, I almost have all of them. Just one more to go and we'll be rulers of all the world then. Yeah, the game's going to be pretty easy from here, viewers. You know, once you get flare books, that's it. It's it's over. Really not much challenge left. Let's see. Where do we go now? Hmm. Oh. There's a nice little ladder. Wow, Skilla is amazing. Can take out just about anything. Okay, we've got new enemies here. Lami or er, Lava Worm. Uh whatever. I, I don't even really care. Let's demonstrate Whirl. Why not? Let's see, Lava Worms are immune to fire, weak to ice. So there you are. Haha! <laughs> kind of like, uh, what is that one? Uh, kind of like Cloud's Finishing Touch, you know? Except it's Game Boy Edition, you know? Huh, okay, apparently there's more to this place still. Hmm, can I see anything else? No, no, not really. Huh, I guess that wasn't the last world after all. Let's just keep moving along, then. Ah, one more world. This must be uh, where the last Magi is. All right. Huh, there's another pillar up there. Maybe that's where the Magi is. Hey, it's Apollo. All right. You know, ha happen to know where the uh, last Magi is? Oh, he has it right now. Okay, well... Let's join forces and save the world! What are you talking about, Apollo? I thought you were a good guy! No, nah, no, not really. <laughs> he wants all of our magi, so we gotta take out his minion! So let's go! Take him out, and then we'll take out Apollo. Yeah! Yeah, and just like uh, finishing touch there, if you don't kill the enemy, uh, just just evaporate into the air. It lands on the ground there, so it's kind of a nice little effect for a Game Boy game. Just use flare, and that'll do a pretty good job on these guys. Or well, just the one really. 
It's a pretty big monster there, Paolo's got. We can take him. Fortunately, he mostly has elemental attacks, so we're okay with that. With the dragon armors and stuff. Yeah, got him. You're mine, Apollo! Oh no! He's taken all of our old friends hostage! Whatever shall we do? You're just gonna give him all the Magi like that? Oh no! Whatever shall we do now? Stop, Apollo! No! It's all over! He has all the Magi! Whatever can we do? Find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy Legend 2! Well, what do you mean you don't want me to cliffhang you here, viewers? Well, so what if I've still got four minutes left? Oh, alright. I'll keep going. Just kidding, viewers! Hey, it's Dad! He's alive! He didn't get killed off after all. What do you mean the last Magi? Apollo had it. Or was he just lying? Oh, okay. So there's actually 78 Magi after all. I like that. That's a nice little plot twist there, you know? Especially for a Game Boy game, you know? They spread the rumor that there's only 77 Magi. But there's really 78, so it's not over after all. I wonder what happens if we go in here. Can we get in there? I don't think we can. No, no, we need a Magi to open that door. So we can't get in there yet, but let's find a place to rest up. The final town. Now, interestingly enough, if you used the Prism Magi before you went there to fight Apollo, uh, it would have said there's two Magi in this world, which would have totally spoiled, you know, the plot twist there, but, you know, I decided to, you know, not spoil that. Oh, okay. Well, we don't have Pegasus Magi anymore. We're, we're, we're out, Magi. But there's a door item that we can get to go back to other worlds. Huh. There's a final dungeon there. Yeah, we may want to take some, uh, some, uh, tents with us, or elixirs, really, but whatever. I'll keep an eye on some stuff. Let's see what they got here. And eh, nothing interesting. Let's see, do they sell the flare books here finally? Yes! I want to stock up on plenty of flare books. I'll do that eventually. Yeah, the final dungeon is just called the final dungeon. That's it. No, nothing creative or anything like that. Just one magi there and that's that. And there's a central shrine that I guess that pillar we passed up will take us to. But we can't get in there yet with no Magi. Sure, why not? Huh, okay. Is he strong against Flare? I think not! So we're gonna bring plenty of that with us. Plenty of Flares. Well then I guess it's just up to us. I mean, just because everyone else died on their way there doesn't mean that we can't take it out. And, ooh, they got some good stuff here. Uh, nothing that I care to buy. Maybe a heal staff, but, eh, I'll think about it. We can get some elixirs and doors. By the way, if you go back to another world, you won't be able to simply walk to the next world because we won't have any magi. But I, from what I heard, I believe the item shops at previous worlds will now have a new salesman who can sell doors to you so you can warp back to uh, the future worlds or the... Higher level worlds. This is the last world, by the way, just so you know. I mean, final world has the final dungeon. So now what I'm going to do is uh, rest up at the end, stock up on flare books, elixirs, heal staffs, whatever I need, and then we'll head to the final dungeon next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy Legend 2. This is H.C. Bailey, signing off. Have a good day.